Welcome to Collingwood Media's Trade Daily. I'm Sarah Allen and this is what's making news on day two of the AFL trade period. The future of Greater Western Sydney midfielder Adam Trelaw remains up in the air, with the Giants fielding several offers, including Collingwood's, for the talented midfielder. Here's what GWS football manager Graham Allen had to say on AFL Trade Radio. Adam Trelaw, because uh, we believe he'll be definitely on the move. How does it all sit with discussions with the Pies? Well, we talk, you know, Adam's a, a loved player by us, um, and he's a valuable player, and we would have loved to have kept him. Mm-hmm. Unfortunately, uh, we couldn't. Um, and there's a number of clubs inquired about him, and, uh, and there's still a long way to go in negotiations. Collingwood is one of several clubs said to be in the mix to secure Melbourne high flyer Jeremy Howe. Brett Anderson told SEN's Hungry for Sport he believes Howe's future may be determined late in the trade period. My feeling on this, and from talking to quite a few people on it, is that Jerry, Jeremy Howe would, would like to get to Collingwood. But the issue is going to be around the fact that they've got the Adam Trelaw stuff, they've got the James A stuff as priorities, and it would then result in having to get that stuff done first, and then whether Ben Kennedy would be uh, able to be involved in a swap then for Jeremy Howe. Meanwhile, North Melbourne is believed to have shown interest in securing both Howe and Magpie wingman Paul Seedsman. The Herald Sun reports North Melbourne has made a bold bid for Howe and Seedsman to strengthen its Premiership assault next year. The Kangaroos want the experienced utilities to add outside polish and flair to complement their core of inside midfielders. In other reports, Fox Sports believes Collingwood could bundle its 2015 first round pick with its 2016 second round pick in a deal that could help land giant gun midfielder Adam Trelaw. Thanks for watching another episode of Collingwood Media's Trade Daily. Join us again tomorrow for all the latest news. We'll see you then.